careful. This van's barely holding together. Good idea. Let's look here. Tasty and Sniffles hung around here a lot. Oh, so many scents and flavors. And lines, man. So many long lines. I'll go find Tasty and Sniffles. So many people eat without really tasting. Yes, we got the double back tag. You know, Vision sounds a lot like my friend Ford. Were you in a band with Ford Color? Ah, uh, good old Vision. I see. Well, maybe when your full memory returns. Wow, look at all the Knicks. They sound hungry. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Circus days, except we never really had crowds. into that hungry crowd, they would eat me. Excuse me? Hang on, kid. We're trying to decide what to order. You can eat after the show. Vision and Psy King are waiting by the van. What? Psy King is back? Let's get our instruments. We've been in this line for so long, I'm not even sure where they are. If so, that's what you should get. Kid, the psyching is back. This is no time for eating. I can't believe I just said that. 
Why don't you just buy new instruments? My instrument is like a part of me. Yes, mine too. But part of me I set down somewhere and I can't remember. If you guys let me take a look, I'll bet I can find them. Oh, Tasty, I can't decide. Well... Maybe I can find their instruments before they make up their minds. I have to admit, I'm a little afraid of this one. Why, because of all the tongues and boogers? <laughs> That's all just part of being in a band, man. Whoa, these things feel... Don't? I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh, God. Now I can taste it. Yeah, back to my regular. 
regular smell again. Which, if I'm being honest, I've never heard any complaints about. without smelling. That's part of life. Oh! That nostril is as hairy as a St. Bernard turned inside out! Did you know that without smelling, most flavors fall flat? That's a nose fact. This area really smells. <laughs> Get him. High five! Wait, don't do that. I go flying like a racket ball. are telling me not to hold this thing too long. is a strong smell. That's a good sign. Can you taste the sky?
Okay, those people just don't appreciate flavor. But I loved it. Ooh, that's a good look on you, Psy King. We need to get the whole band back together, am I right? We need Dr. Touch. And we need audio. The audience hates us. I can taste it. <gasps> so, why aren't you the singer? You wouldn't ask that if you ever heard the Psyching sing. He is amazing. He's the best. Oh, please. You're making me blush. So, why aren't you the singer? You wouldn't ask that if you ever heard the sight. Oh, please, you're making me Isn't blush. I very funny. Isn't I? So. You wouldn't. Oh, please, you're making me blush. You I mean, psyching. I'm a little overwhelmed, but you know, too much sense is better than none, right? Hey, how are you, Bollop? I'm a too much sense is better than none, right? Ow! Now you've done it. Excited about getting the band back together, Vision? I will be as soon as Audio and Dr. Touch are with us. I should probably get back in the field. Suitcase tag. That's what I need here. Maybe senses were a bad idea. Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Can't beat that old van smell. Where are we going? They might have wandered into the campgrounds. Good idea. Let's look here. Well, this is the campground. Dr. Touch and Artie used to like to come here. They like to get high out here. So, you're saying they're up there? Yep. The view up there is amazing. It's good to see you again, Vision. I say it's good to see anything. Am I right? I feel like I'm about to go on stage. Stay calm, man. Stay. I've heard about music festivals like this. This one is surprising, really. I think I hear some emotional baggage here.
case tag. Gotcha. We always do. No, we don't. See? Here you go. Me? You started this. Oh, choo-choo. Here comes the blame train. For someone who's all ears, you really don't know how to listen. For someone who's all fingers, you've really lost your grip on reality. Are you full of wax or something? Look, I don't want to play. Me either. Let's just be quiet. Fine with me. Me too. I heard that. Didn't you guys see the huge crowd down there? People are screaming for the Feast of the Senses. That's what I've been telling this one. But the problem with him is that he just won't listen. Without Psyking, there is no feast. There's nothing. But Psyking is back. What? He's down by the van with Vision. But we're not ready. We haven't practiced. Dr. Touch, where are our instruments? I thought you had them. We need those instruments. The crowd's getting angry. Hey, that kind of pressure is not helping. Yes, that makes us just want to stay up here. We're in safe. Maybe you could perform without your instruments? What could we possibly perform without our instruments? Hmm. Magic? I do know a little sleight of hand, you know. Please. Let me take a look. I bet I can find it. Sounds good to me. Let me give you a hand. Coming up. Hey, I love what they've done with the place. Okay, let's get those instruments and get out of here. If I know Audie, this is gonna sound awesome. Oh, and Dr. Touch is good too. Oh. Oh.
guys. I really think it's time to get rid of these things. sound of one hand clapping. And it's deafening! Just calm down, okay? Oh, I gotta say, Saking, you're almost looking like your old self again. I'm sorry I abandoned the band, you guys. Hey, it's gonna make for a better rockumentary someday. Time for the feast. Feast! Just a thought is all I've got Now my cover's low At the bottom of a lake Of frozen feeling When my friends pulled me back up I started Healing molecule through my cosmic eye Senses are the magic keys They fill the holes I've had Unlocking all my memories I never From Lobato's nightmare. I know her from my nightmares. <laughs> Don't worry. All your friends are here. Friends? Oh, do you mean these friends? The ones who abandoned him in the ice for 20 years. Don't listen to her. Their universe, please. Shut up!
There we go. That's better. Problem solved. Ball of light? You're a helmet full bear! Everyone thinks you died in the deluge of Grulovia. What happened? <sighs> I can't remember much of anything. Well, if you don't mind, I can try to help with that. This is my stupid plan to defeat Maligula. You okay? So far. You were going to act her to death? I did a monologue about Lucy's life and what she meant to us. To try and bring her back. I was useless that day. You were useless that day? I tried to stop her with a motivational speech. Actually, Full Bear, you distracted her long enough that I was able to recruit some local animals to help. Which also didn't work. We all brought what we had to the battle. The main thing was, your beautiful performance did bring out the old Lucy. Just for a bit. It reminded us that she was in there. So, Maligula used to be... your friend? And her name was... Lucy? <sighs> Is she the seventh member of the Psychic Six? Lucretia Mux? I'm learning a lot. Yeah, me too. I'm right here! Where are you going? Why did you all abandon me for a thousand years? Twenty. Maybe in your world? Did they even look for me? Did they all forget I existed? We did look for you, fool bear. But my stupid hyper high glaciator there, which we brought to freeze Maligula, well, it's a... Uh... It worked as designed, Otto. But you were so deep in that frozen lake, we couldn't find you. No matter how much we duck. I know you're just speculating here, Helmet. I think you're probably right. But I sent you my brain, Ford. Didn't you find it? I... I don't know. Ford must have brought your brain back because I found it in Otto's lab. But he must have lost that memory when his mind was shattered in the battle. My brain was shattered? Well, come on. It was a little crack to begin with. My body's been in hyper ice all this time. I'll bet I look amazing. Almost done. I'm starting to enjoy it now. Oh no, I can't look. This is where that monster drowned my Bobby. Because I failed. Because my stupid plan couldn't save him. No, you saved me. You threw yourself into the path of danger, sacrificing yourself to save me. Rather dramatically, I might add. Well, I mean, thank you. So, I'm not dead. I'm out there somewhere waiting for you to come back to me. I'm coming to you, right now. I swear. Better hurry. You know how I get. Memories, my boy. Just a show we put on inside our heads. Sometimes the first draft of the script stinks. 
Thanks for helping me with the rewrites. Now let's go give the people what they want. <laughs> Everybody stand back. Remember, this is our friend, Lucy. She's going through a tough time. I think she might just need someone to listen to her. Save your sympathy for your strawberry, Donato. Time out, Lulu. Your body yet for bear, but not to worry. I've got your brain, and I'm gonna keep it safe back at HQ and come back for the rest of you. Just after I figure out what to do with Lucy. Okay, I know you won't forget about me. I don't think anybody's gonna forget about you after that performance. In fact, I think they're demanding an encore. Senior staff only. I'm... Who am I again? Nick John Smith. Nick John Smith, senior mailroom staff. Welcome, Helmet Forbear, deceased. About time they sent me an assistant. Ford's gonna be so excited when he figures out who you really are, Agent Forbear. Everybody is. Kid, I owed you one, and now we're square. But I'm not ready to face Cruller. Not until I talk to Bob. But... Lots of baggage to unpack. You wouldn't understand. But please, tell no one of my return. But... I'll see you at curtain call! Oh, somebody shut that door before the wind blows all my letters away! Excuse me, Agent Cruller? Clerk Cruller. Yes? How are you feeling? Busy. It's like nobody's been sorting the mail for days. Would you mind if I, uh, went inside your mind and sorted a few things out? Eh, I'm never opposed to anything getting properly sorted. Dear Ford, we brought peace to Grulovia, but there is still unrest among the people. A little ungrateful, I think. Home soon, Lucretia.
a Ford's mind in here for me to reconnect, it'll probably be up in that giant clunky head. Hey, I came out of that clunky head. Really? Can you help me get in there? Uh, maybe, to tell you the truth. I'm not addressed very well, so... I'm sure I'll be marked return to sender and sent back there soon. Just grab off. Did someone say return to sender? But this letter's got no return address. I'm afraid that means the dead letter office for you. But wait, I'm a heartfelt love letter. Don't care who you courted, the feelings must get sorted. Think I could stop a war? Bah, doesn't matter. I never sent it. Maybe it would have saved a thousand lives. Maybe just one. I wonder what would have happened if I'd sent that letter. I wonder if it's too late. I don't belong in here. Lucy, haven't heard from you in a while. Send us a card, or better yet, come home. We miss hey, you. Hey, over here! Four. If I get you out of here, will you still take me up to the head? Yes, but quick, before him. Whoa! Ah! Oh, my mistake. This doesn't belong in the dead letter office. <laughs> Look at that address. It belongs in the international dead letter office. What? No, wait. Uh oh. War protests threaten peace. Stop. Late unwashed in the cold shower. Stop. Four grew over. Bizarre fear. Ah, there we go.
Lucy, your last letter frightened us. You don't sound like yourself. We're just worried about you. Love, Ford, and friends. That's better. Now where are the rest? Still too missing. Keyboard is almost complete. Just one key missing. But where is it? Yep. not enough to secure my reign. Stop being coy with the hoy to loy.
hear something. The people have a no nickname for me. They call me... Oh, sounds serious. I take it as a compliment. I like it so much, in fact. I can't remember being called by another name. Just hold still. I'm gonna get you out of here. Oh, no. <sighs> Some letters are such a pain in the neck, they really belong in the furnace. Wait. I think I know how to address this one. Really? Well, it's worth a shot. But don't take all day. The mail must sail into tomorrow, no time to borrow. Boy, I hope you know what you're doing. That's a key to the typewriter. Well, you can. I don't wanna go! I don't think I have all the keys I need to properly address this enemy. Is that the missing typewriter key? and see what we get. You see? A male just doesn't matter.
private mailbox. You aren't allowed in here. You've been missorted. You touch that, and it's a federal crime. Go on. What did you say in that letter? Nothing important, really. Just that I loved her. She just wanted to help, but they, they pushed her too far. Well, how should we have known? It's not like she was marked fragile. But I thought I knew her and everything she held inside herself. Ah, I had so much to learn. I guess some packages are better left unopened. Only one more piece of Ford's mind to reconnect. I'm making progress. But what if Maligula shows up here? And Ford's not ready. I need to hurry up. Hey, did the brain tumbler ever get deloused? Yes, I finally did it myself. The infestation was my fault, anyway. Should have kept a closer eye on that school tour group. Yes, I'm ready to go to the collective unconscious. Looks like Sasha's implanted office construct hasn't completely broken down yet. Could you give me a lift?
I'll take this nugget. I wreck. Hey, little buddy. I need to get somewhere quick. Thanks, buddy. May I trouble you for a bubble? That always makes me a little dizzy.
give me a lift? Thanks for the ride! Somewhere quick. Got a little bubble juice in my nose that time. some emotional baggage nearby. <laughs> All of Lobato's emotional baggage is now sorted. Maybe he'll be better now? Trouble you for a bubble? I recognize that sound. My little friend is back. Hey, little buddy. I need to get somewhere quick. That always makes me a little dizzy. Guess you want your cut of the winnings? No way. I can't have this trace back to me. In fact, I'm skipping town. The boss is not gonna like what just happened. What? Why? Take my advice. Don't win anything else today. Thanks. 
Thanks, buddy. I think I hear something. I sorted all the emotional baggage in Agent Forsythe's mind. It's the least I could do after the trouble I caused. May I trouble you for a bubble? Thanks for the ride! bubble juice in my nose that time. somewhere quick. I don't want to bother the feast during their encore. I'll just sneak around and clean up, like a roadie. Trouble you for a bubble? Thanks for the ride. Hey, 
know, buddy. I need to get some... Got a little bubble juice in my nose that time. emotional baggage in Helmet's mind. Wonder if I can be in the band now. Trouble you for a bubble? Thanks, buddy.
always makes me a little dizzy. May I trouble you for a bubble? Thanks for the ride! Well, this place is still up and running. I guess you really can't stop the mail. Could you give me a lift? What am I missing? Don't be too hard on yourself, kid. <laughs> Anybody know what time it is? Scanning. 
for thinker print. Just like my nephew. A little jerk. No. Hello. Hey, Sonny. Hey! Time bubble fans, you're going to love these new time. fans you're going to love these new time bubble pins check out these new time bubble pins save that until you rank up for best results just what i was going to recommend I'll admit, the main appeal of that one is looks. No refunds. Hey! Yep. <laughs> Sup, little guy? Want to see my oarsman's badge? No? here not for little kids <laughs> oh. crazy you up here I'm telling mom you threw a rock at me it was a pine cone you baby ow that was a rock I'm warning you
Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through here all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that if you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Frazy? <sighs> Ow! More where that came from. The entrance to the forgetful forest is somewhere here in the questionable area. <gasps> Guess my family has chosen where to set up the Aquato Dome. Hard luck. Go 
see Mom in the campgrounds. She's worried sick about you. Hmm. Sensing some stray thoughts? Okay. Let's see if there are any stray thoughts around. Nope, that's not it. Just a little farther. Found some thoughts. Thanks, Thought Tutor. Give you. Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh. What matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one flowing upside down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nona. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it. Guess. The upside down waterfall? The devil's fire hose. Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Queepy on the bottom. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. Now, Rasputin, up top you go. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We. Oui. Our acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys. Why not a little of both? Pops. Oh, cretin. You guys. Oh, shush. This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the aquatron. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Pooty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. If there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. What was I doing out here again? Oh, right. Compton needs a key from the forgetful forest. Ah, 
The animals here are fast. Hi, Nona. Oh, hello, my sweet little turnip. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? I'm happy as long as I'm with my family. Aren't you cold out here in the woods? Ah, oh, please. I'm from Grulovia. This is nothing. Can I ask you about the curse? Don't go near the water. Yes, I know about that part, but then you know the whole thing. All you need to know. Do you hate psychics as much as mom? You mean fortune tellers? Like the Galakios, the ones who cursed us? They are not neutral. They are not trustworthy. Nona, who's your favorite grandchild? It's me, right? Oh, of course, you are my favorite. My sweet little Dion. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy, now don't get that big head. Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes, and she looks really impressed. <laughs> Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. Hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? What you doing? I'm trying to perfect the devil's fire hose, of course. It's a risky one, but I think this might be the spectacle that puts the Aquatos back on top. Can I help? Yes. Tell me how to make the devil's fire hose reach even greater heights. How about some sight? Finish that sentence, and it will kill your mother, Rasputin. Maybe if everyone stood on tippy toes? Everyone is already stretched to their full height. I should know. I stretch them every day. What if we incorporate animals into the act? Overall, children are cheaper and slightly cleaner. What if we set everyone's costumes on fire? Very exciting. But these are the only costumes we have, Rasputin. Seems like doing the trick horizontally would be safer. Safety doesn't fill seats, Rasputin. Well, that's all the ideas I got. Sorry. Hmm. You really want to help me? Go find your brother, Queepy. He's wandered off again. Top of what? Top of the acrobatic world, Rasputin. As the Aquatos once were. Before the curse. Can I ask you about the curse? Not too long. You know your father doesn't like to talk about it. But as you know, a cruel fortune teller cursed our family, Raz. Every Aquato for all time is cursed to die in water. That is why we had to leave our grand aquatic circus behind and start again at the bottom in this humble family troop. We may not have water anymore, but we still have the most important thing, right? We still have... Family. Highly stretchable ligaments! Oh, yes, and family. Who cursed us? Too many questions! Stay away from the water! That's all we need. I stopped arguing with that woman long ago. You know, Agent Foresight is a very important psychonaut. And she's really cool, actually. I think you'd really like each other if you hung out. The woman in the suit? Uh, we get along just fine. As long as we keep our distance. A circus can only have one prima donna. Sorry about running away. It's okay, Rasputin. 
I blame myself. Really? Why? I forgot to latch your door that night. You... you latch our door at night? From the outside? Only since Queepy started sleepwalking. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. 